Rockefeller Wildlife Refuge spans 26 miles of coastline and receives one of the highest rates of erosion in the state at 46 feet per year. This December, Rockefeller has a shoreline project up for a quipper vote, ME18. This project would provide two and a half miles of shoreline protection by building segmented breakwaters. Breakwaters, or rock walls, can be placed just off the coastline and do a number of things. First, they reduce the rate of erosion. The wave energy is slowed by the breakwater and the constant force of waves hitting the coast is greatly reduced. Second, the slowed wave energy is able to fill in behind the breakwater. The sediment that is carried on shore drops out of the water column and is trapped behind the very same breakwater. Over time, the sediment accrues, plants begin to take root, and land begins to build outward toward the rocks. Parts of Rockefeller's coast have shell hash instead of sands. These loose, broken bits of shell can move with the tides and the wind. Without shoreline protection, the shell hash is continually moved further inland, suffocating the marsh grasses that lie just beyond the beach. The grasses die, and the root structure is no longer there to hold onto the sediment, and the beach erodes. On December 10th in Baton Rouge, Louisiana, members of the Quipra Technical Committee will vote on ME18. There isn't enough funding for all the projects being proposed, so we need public input to ensure that ME18 is implemented and the high rate of erosion at Rockefeller reversed.